Thanks for joining us on the Weekly Scoop. Quickly, let's look at the top player report. Black Chili Wing caught this mistake. Zeke's rating should actually be 1311 after red. Uh, I do have confirmation on KB versus G. Cole for the crown in the 5C category. That should be interesting considering last time these guys met. It weren't too pretty for G. Cole, that is. Uh, six to six four category after a couple of unsuccessful Kickstarter campaigns for a Smallville Dre Baldwin match, we've decided to do the right thing and let J Rock take a stab at the crown. Just last night, I watched game twenty between J Rock and A to the G. It was uh, such a good fight. I think J Rock Smallville will be something to see. Okay, let's talk to the man himself, D Train, and see what he has to say about it. Yo, 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 what's up? First of all, you had a fan you had a fan call in and she said uh Cato crossed the line. Hey, I I I got your back. Don't even worry about it. You know what I'm saying? Don't even worry. Don't even stress about that because Cato for the get here. I got a dude that's six six, two fifty, that's gonna destroy you, dude. Hey, you send my boy and off, but hey man, hey. Life is what you make it, man. Hey, you finna go up against a dominant force. Hey, Chris Flash is a is a quote is a, uh from uh from U T. He's six six. He got gay. He'll bang you. He'll shoot you. He'll cross over you. U T. Man, U T. Longhorns. I'm repping them Longhorns, man. Understand? I'm just I'm just saying. He gonna take the crown. Well, all right, man. It was good. Hey, it was good to talk to you today. And uh, it's cool that you have supporters calling in, letting you know they stand behind you. And uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. well, all right, man. Well, thank you, and, and we'll we'll catch up with you later on. All right. Chris Price, former UT player, six six and two hundred and fifty pounds, representing Team D Train, going over to six eight to seven foot. I need to see if Tedrick versus O'Neal is a even a possibility. Uh, both are professional players. O'Neal spending a lot of time overseas, and Tedrick having played briefly in the NBA, but um, out for an injury or something. I'm not exactly sure what happened, but I will be definitely following up with both of those guys soon. And now international news. As you know from the UK, London to be specific, pro street baller the con man has called us out. Y'all can check out that video. Will that translate into an actual game? I don't know. For right now, however, anyone with the balls to do a call-out can certainly expect the V1F to come knocking in the future. Over to Germany, Mr. Mike, the number one street baller in Germany and V1F licensed producer, has put out another game. Click on that to get your one-on-one -on -one fix if you need it. Of course, we'd like you to subscribe to Mr. Mike, give the vid a like, that's going to help the V1F's global movement and get professional one-on-one -on -one basketball to neighborhoods where hopefully some of you guys can access the Federation and get that rating and get in. Um, I know a lot of young guys hit me up all the time and wanting to play. Guys around the world want to play. Uh, you got to be 18 to play right now until we expand and grow and we can grow into other things. But my advice for young guys that that aren't of age is to just get ready i mean time flies so start getting ready now because uh, v1f is gonna be big stay tuned for more games and keep playing one-on-one -on -one. one love all around the world first one peace out